All right. Welcome, everybody, to game 14 of Backyard Baseball Season 4. Last game before the playoffs. Should be pretty interesting. We are still undefeated. 13 wins, zero losses, and it's our final home game on Ekman Acres, and we are up against the Yankees today. New York Yankees. And I don't know how well they've been faring uh, thus far. Actually, wait, we can find out, can't we? Where are those Yankees? Yankee Doodle came to town riding on a pony. I don't see them anywhere. Oh, they've only won four games. <laughs> okay, they've only won four games. Statist statistics show they shouldn't be a terribly difficult team. But we all know that that doesn't necessarily mean anything. It should be interesting, though, for sure. Uh, we've we got a pretty solid team thus far. I'm quite confident that we can go undefeated at least up until the playoffs. However, once we reach the playoffs, we start getting up, going up against pretty much nothing but good teams, so that's where things get a lot more difficult. Well, all right, well, let's take a look at the roster and see how our team is faring. Pablo is feeling great. Kenny's doing A-OK. -okay. Charlie Brown's on point. Pete Wheeler is just raring to go. Angela is the same as always. Kimmy's got those classic Ekman Acres increases, which means that she's going to be a formidable opponent today. Reese Worthington is doing just fine. Marky's doing okay, and Annie's feeling good again. Yes! All right. No decreases today, and Kimmy's got the increases. That's great. All right. I think I'm going to be moving back to the old lineup of Pablo third and then Angela fourth. The Pete Reese Kenny combo worked really well in the first inning, but it backfired in the future innings when I didn't start with Pete. So I think this is going to be more consistent, even if it won't be as solid of a start. All right, and after Angela, let's see. I am moving Marky to the back of the lineup. Actually, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. I'm moving Kenny to the back of the lineup. I'm moving Marky to second to the back of the lineup. And yes, this is the classic. I like it. <laughs> this is how we're going to deal with it. This is the batting order that we're choosing. I want Kenny as last just because he is worse at batting than Marky. And he actually has some speed to him, which means that he's not going to slow Pete down. But man, Marky's been disappointing offense-wise this season. I don't know what's wrong with him. It's almost like he's actually a five at batting and he's now behaving like it. <laughs> I just don't know what happened. All right, let's see what the Yankees have in store for us. They've got Colleen Clinker. She's in the clink. She's not so good. Uh, Kathy Wolf is speed, but stinks at everything else. Derek Jeter, but he's got decreases, so he's not as good today. All right, Ingrid Dahlman. She's okay. Nan Porter. Oh, it's Nan. And she's maxed at pitching. That's good. Amir Khan. Okay, if memory serves, Amir Khan does not have a very good arm. So, this could be great if he's the catcher. This actually could be very good. Uh, Cindy Chain, she's pretty fast, but has no batting at all. Hillary Vargas is okay, is pretty decent at batting. And then Holly Franklin is kind of fast. Okay, okay. I'm not too worried today. And if, unless Amir just suddenly has an amazing throw today, I'm pretty sure the only reason he has a good arm when I had him is because he was on the same team as Ahmed. But by himself, I don't think he can throw it very hard which means we might be able to steal a whole bunch today, which is great. And now looking at their lineup, who are their slowest characters? So... Ingrid is not terribly fast. Uh, Kathy is, though. Nan... Okay, Nan and Amir. Amir is not super fast, and Nan is going to get gassed because she's their pitcher. So... Okay, okay. There are maybe a couple of double play opportunities, but I'm nothing too definite, so it might just be a very regular game of baseball today. All right, I'm pretty confident. They've got some speedy characters, but none of their characters is, like, really good at batting today, so I don't think they'll be getting any home runs. Also, I, uh, maybe I mentioned it last time, but I want to get a home run with Kimmy today. If she doesn't get a home run today, she's probably not getting a home run unless we get the aluminum power bat. Because this is the last time she's going to be a 9 out of 10 at batting. Otherwise, she's just going to be a 6 out of 10, which is nowhere near as good. So let's try to get a home run for Kimmy today, and let's win the game. Welcome to the last game of the season. All the teams have made it this far, but only two will be moving on to the playoffs. Hiya, folks! Welcome to Backyard Baseball. I'm Sunny Day, along with my broadcast partner, Vinny the Gooch. Folks, we're 
we're going to bring you the best in baseball today. Home runs, triple plays, strikeouts, live action from some of the hottest players in the league this season. The best in baseball. Boy, you're sure enthusiastic today. I had a good breakfast. And a corn dog, apparently. We'll feature a fierce competition between the New York Yankees and the Crazy Bombers. At this point, these kids have already made it to the playoffs. But if I know this team, they're gonna give this last season game everything they've got just for the love of baseball. And now, kids, it's time for some action. Let's hear it for the best team in the BBL, the Bombers. Heck yeah. New York Yankees, they've only won four times. <laughs> no shot that they win, right? Unless the game really cheeses me hard. But I don't think that'll happen. The game would never cheese me, right? Right? Probably not. Of course not. <laughs> Only two can make the playoffs. Yeah, that's definitely not true. Four teams... Actually, no, I think eight teams make the playoffs. Four teams make the tournament, and then two teams make the World Series. Also, um... Hang on. What was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Also, they mentioned this is the last game of the season. It's not. It's just the last game of the normal league games. So, I don't know. Some losers lose all the time, which is the side you occupy. <laughs> yes, that's the new sound alert. <laughs> Nobody's lost yet, but, I mean, we, we, we can keep that in mind. <laughs> yeah, New York Yankees versus Crazy Bombers, Ekman Akers. I'm pretty sure we got this in the bag, but I really just want to hope that Kimmy Ekman uh, gets a home run. That's really all that I want today, and also to win. All right, we got Cindy up first, and she's pretty fast. So let's, let's catch her out by throwing the slow ball, right? Oh, well, yeah, presumably she would bunt. You fool, Kimmy Ekman is on point today. She's got the juice today, so she can pitch a great game. Another f bunt. Man, it's a good thing Kimmy's got a speed increase. Good li Yeah, they're going to have a hard time <laughs> getting on base, I think. Uh-oh, it's Jeter. Thankfully, Jeter's not a big deal today because he's got decreases in his offensive stats. Yeah. Yeah, you probably should have, Derek. But, I mean, you're probably going to want to not bunt. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, <laughs> that's that's the old pepper. That's the old soda pop boy. <laughs> do, 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 do. Strikeout! Oh yeah, one, two, three inning, and we get a power up. Nice job, Pete. You haven't done anything, but I'm already saying nice job. We're gonna bunt. No way Amir is able to throw it in faster than Pete can run. Right? Are they gonna say that's a foul? Yes, they are. Well, shoot. Pete would be really good at bunting, but he just fouls it too much. Really? Mm, shoot. Doggone it, Pete. All right, fine. We'll hit a grounder then. Surely that's too low. Good. I wish Pete had better eyesight, because it's really annoying trying to guess where the ball's going to go. You know, you could have just walked Pete to save us all some trouble. He's getting on first regardless. Yikes! Okay, Nan has got a arm. Beautiful. Okay, so she gets Reese out. Pete's on second. <laughs> Vinny, calm down. I think if they put Jeter as the catcher, he would probably be really good. Oh! There we go! Pablo's back! <laughs> what? Whoever finds that ball is gonna have a tattoo? I've never heard that dialogue before. <laughs> Aw, yeah! Alright, two points in the first inning. That's always great. It's always great to score in the first inning. 
<laughs> Amir was not happy. He's just like, oh! I'm gonna smack That's true. Pablo always pops off in the postseason. For sure. Okay. Wow, fa thank you for just saying that was foul and not giving Amir a chance to catch it. I do appreciate that. From the wind up and the pitch. Swung on. All right, Nan is a pretty solid pitcher. I, I respect it. I respect it, Nan. Darn, that was dumb. All right, Annie. Let's get that line drive. Okay, that was a pop-up. Why did you run off... Wow. I'm glad they both ran for the ball, because if uh, their first base... What the? Wow, what the... What is going on? Man, it was just like, I'm going to kill the first baseman. She just, she just smacked that girl, like, five times. All right, Shelby Brown. No shot that you missed this, right? No shot you missed this. You're a solid player. Okay, well, you didn't miss it, but also, that's an easy out. I love how people are always just waiting for that. They're just like, okay, Charlie Brown is up at bat. I'm just going to preemptively have my finger on the OG <laughs> alert. I love it. All right, it's time for Hillary. Oh, right to Kenny. Big mistake. Kenny jumped. He's in a wheelchair, and he jumped to get that. What a chad. All right, Amir, generally not the best batter, but he can definitely pull out some power hits. Like that. Wow. Amir, why couldn't you have ever hit that hard when you were on my team? Okay. Amir's on first. That's fine. Amir's pretty... Well, actually, he's not super slow. Especially if he's not the main pitcher. He actually has some speed. All right. And Nan is currently still pretty juiced up, so she's going to be fast as well. Oh, that's... <laughs> Reese, get him out. Get her out. Yes! Double play! Oh, man, my team is on point for defense today. If we get aluminum power bat, then that's a home run for Kimmy. <laughs> okay, screaming line drive. Well, we're going power with Kimmy. I want to get that home run. I really do. Okay. No! No! <laughs> I was really hoping that would hit her in the back of the head and knock her down. All right, Marky. <laughs> We're hitting line drive today because you can't hit power, apparently. <laughs> Point three two five. What kind of a batting average is that, Marky? <laughs> you got you got to fix that. <laughs> no, don't swing at that. Come on, that they spit on that ball. How's that even allowed? How's that even allowed? That ain't sanitary. <laughs> we don't even do that on the farm. That's just nasty. Oh, doggone it, Marky can't hit left hooks. Stop throwing left hooks at Marky. His bat is physically incapable of hitting those. Ready now. And the pitch. The wing. Doggone it, Marky. <laughs> You're a disappointment. Marky's really got to work on his batting. <laughs> he's, he's slacking this season. Okay, Kenny. Eyes on the ball. Wow, that's probably the farthest Kenny's ever hit the ball on a regular bat. And Nan just catches it with, the, with her back turned to it because she's that cool. <laughs> Mad respect to Nan. She's she's doing great. Wow. There's a batting average you don't see every day on the final game of the league. Wow. 14 games and you have never made it to base? You have to try to be that bad. Guys, we can't let her get on base, alright? We, we can't. 
What the? She's got some power behind her, so that really surprises me. Oh, doggone it, you hit Rabbit's Carrot Extractor again. <laughs> Everyone was just collectively like, Ooh! Ooh! It's like we're playing Donkey Kong 64 multiplayer. Sorry, Colleen! Keeping that zero. Yeah, I'd be that mad too if I was at a zero batting average this late in the series. It's Holly! Oh, cool. Ice and fire. I love those pitches. Now's a good time to use a breaking ball. On on Franklin? I don't know about that. Hey, it's Franklin. Coming down to play. I think Angela's doing just fine on her own using hooks and slow balls. Booyah! See? She doesn't need the breaking balls. <laughs> she just looks a little disappointed in herself. She's like, oh. Ingrid. Go back to Fire Emblem Free Houses. Alright! Alright, Vinny. I'll turn on the heat and smoke that bad. Excuse me. Okay, okay. We're doing solidly. Let's do a slow ball. Slow ball's my favorite. Simple, low energy. <laughs> they generally don't get home runs off of slow balls. Okay, Ingrid's, Ingrid is trying to tire me out. All right, fine. Then we'll throw the hook. We'll throw the hook. Wow. Props to Ingrid for actually making contact all this time. I don't want to use a fireball, though, because Angela's going to be up at bat this next inning. Here we go. This is all you, Kimmy. Yeah! I'm gonna hit a touchdown. You actually don't need to, Pete. We can just hit a bunt and not foul it. Pete, how do you whiff a bunt? I don't understand. Thank you. Thank you. It only took 14 games for you to do that. They're trying to bait me. I'm not going to second. Okay, I want Reese to get on base. So, we are not swinging at the first pitch. We're just going to let Pete steal. Yeah, look at that. Amir is such a bad catcher. Look at that. He flubbed it twice. I almost could have gone to third. Okay, let's... No, I like grounder with Reese. Line drive has a chance of being a pop-up. That's too low. I guess it wasn't too low. Of course it wasn't. It's okay, Reese. When you actually swing, you swing to win. Doggone it. You just know they would have called it a strike if I hadn't swung, too. <laughs> Everyone's cheering for Reese when I already know he's struck out. Okay, well... Oh, shoot. Wait, no. Go back, Pete. Go back. And he's out. Tag second. And he's Rats! Out. I should not have swung at that. That was gonna be a ball anyways, but it was outside, so it was too good to pass up. Whoa-ho! Boom! Shaka! Laka! No shot. Okay, no, hang on. She's got a good arm. Good job, Angela! Very good job. I believe this is where we pull out the screaming line drive. This is where we pull out that screaming line drive. Boom. Oh, shoot. She's running out of options. This is quite a predicament. Looks like she tripped. Okay, that was a mistake. Wow, thank you, Jeter, for not being on the... <laughs> Jeter wasn't standing on the base, and because it didn't get the out, the girl shoved him over. That was hilarious. Okay, well, that's definitely an out. No question. It doesn't even matter. Look how slow Angela is. She's out. 
Darn it. Well, I gassed my pitcher. That's okay. You know what? It was worth using our screaming line drive just for that hilarious moment. Cheater getting shoved to the ground. Yeah, I know. Okay, it's Cindy. She's fast, and that's it. She got no bat. No bat at all. She's probably gonna bunt, right? Yeah, she's probably gonna bunt. Oh, shoot. It's Angela. 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 Darn it! That's not good. I don't want a speedster on first base. <laughs> no matter what I do, Marky's always just like, Doggone, that's good! <laughs> it's like, Marky, no, it's not. Uh oh. Annie, you got this, right? I don't even have to move with you. What? What? But she caught it! But she caught it! Who's the ump? I've got a, I've got some words for the ump. Well, maybe we can get a double play. I hope Jeter bunts, but he's not going to, because that would be very dumb. If he bunts, though, we're getting a double play. Yikes! Okay. You know what? Maybe we need to get Jeter out. Hang on. Who's who's after? Who's up at bat now? Oh, she's also scary, though. Let's get Jeter out. I don't like how powerful Jeter is with all of those fouls he was getting. Alright. Hillary's up next. Now, thankfully, Hillary is not as fast as Jeter is. Yikes! But she's powerful! What the heck? We'll never fix Rabbit's Carrot Extractor now. And we don't have any fireballs. Come on, please don't. Yikes, I don't like this. Okay, that's a foul. I don't like how Hillary keeps... <laughs> oh, she got 81 power? Shoot. I gotta hope for that strikeout, or that she barely hits it for some reason. No, she keeps hitting it! And I used up my juice box. Come on, please get her out! Thank you! No double play this inning, but I'm not risking a free run home run with Hillary. Yikes. Okay, well, Amir may very well get a monster hit, like he did last, uh, <laughs> last time he was up at bat. Yes, yeah, she is. I know she is. Alright, let's keep him coming. Okay, there we go. Okay, Kenny just wheel on over, get her out. Booyah. Good old reliable Kenny Kawaguchi. Alright, Kimmy, let's see if you can get the home run this inning. If you don't get it this inning, you may not get another chance. Really, Kimmy? You're nine at batting, and that is what you give me? Gosh, she is so bad. Even when she's got crazy increases, she's bad. Except that field. She is a really good catcher. <sighs> Alright, Marky. Try not to disappoint me again this inning, son. Okay, Marky, you actually finally made contact with the ball, but it, you still didn't even come close to hitting it forward. <laughs> Stop it with the insults, Pa! I can do this! Way to go, Marky! You hit it two inches! That's great. If you run, maybe you'll make it in time. No, you don't, because you're a slowpoke. Oh, Lord, Marky. You're embarrassing me. Wow! Right to the first baseman! But that is definitely the farthest Kenny's hit it before. 
in this version of the game. Well, that's about what I expected. Angela, there was no reason for you to, to trip there. Well, we still got the out. Alright, it's Colleen. This, is a, this should be just an instant guaranteed out, right? With that zero batting average. <laughs> She's a sensitive math nerd. I'm sorry. I also don't want to think about my grandma tripping. That would not be good. Okay, can we strike her out and get a juice box, please? And me wished on a juice box, and that's what started Dragon Tales. I'm pretty sure that's how it goes, right? I wish I wish with all my heart to drink juice in a land apart. Or will that give me the fireball? Oh, thank you, Dragon Tales. I appreciate it. Get her out. Yeah, good job, Angela. Follow the hostess. Your table is waiting. Angela's gotten quite a few strikeouts in this game. Good job, AD. All right, hey, this looks familiar. We're back to start with Pete. All over it out there today. Actually, this is almost certainly our last at bat. Oh yeah, there is no way Kimmy is getting up to bat again. No way. This is going to be a short I'm game. Gonna hit a touchdown. Pete, are you going to be able to bunt? That's really all I want to know. Are you going to be able to bunt? Doggone it, Pete Wheeler. Doggone it, Pete Wheeler. I always have to hit a grounder with Pete. He can't bunt. <laughs> There we go. A bouncing ball. That little blue. Run, Pete, run, Pete, running. run, Pete. Flaps out a single. Good job, good job. All right, Pete, yours or Pete, <laughs> Reese, you're zero for two today. We don't want that. Pete can steal. I don't care if you're throwing a strike. Why does he always say that whenever I successfully steal? He's like, oh man, you actually stole base successfully? I don't know if I would have done that. Like, well, it worked for us. Not swinging. I don't care if it's a strike. Alright, Reese. Take a big breath of inhaler, and let's get going. Alright, that's the Reese specialty. I know, Amir. I'll try to give you one. I, I did? What do you want from me, uh, Amir? Surely that's not a strike. That actually was technically overlapping with the shadow a little bit, but I'm glad the ump is on my side this time. Okay, that's not much of a grounder now, is it? Wow! Darn, imagine what Reese could have done if I had had him hit power. <laughs> Good job, Reese! Oh! That's a power hit, but that may not be in the... Oh, but she dropped it! She's a lunkhead. Alright. Good job. Alright, Angela, now it's your turn to get a home run. I'm... that's not great. I'm not saying Annie's bad, but... Annie can't get it into the outfield with as much consistency as Del Vecchio. Well, let's, let's see what comes of this. Let's see what comes of this, Annie. I believe in you. So much for the line drive. Nice job, Reese! Nice job. That was great. Oh, talk on it. Alright, Charlie Brown. Don't screw this up, Charlie Brown. 
Don't screw this up, Charlie Brown. <laughs> this is the field, though, that Charlie Brown randomly hit the home run, so... Oh, man, if he hits the Grand Slam, this will be the most epic thing ever. <laughs> Charlie Brown, just take the walk! <laughs> I could be a hero. <laughs> oh, what a rip! How did they know he was gonna be there, though? Run, Reese. <gasps> Guys! Kimmy Ekman has a chance to get a Grand Slam. Kimmy? This is literally the opportunity. The opportunity! To get us a home run. Come on, Kimmy Ekman, please. We, we need we need energy in chat. We need we need energy in chat. I don't Oh the the bringing in Kathy Wolf. I don't care if nobody's redeemed it. I, I thought the coach believed in you, Kimmy. I thought the coach believed in you. Okay. Oh, somebody already beat me to it. Okay. <laughs> yes. Come on, Kimmy. You're a star. You can get a Grand Slam. Wow, they're really using up their fireball. They really don't want Kimmy to be able to get that Grand Slam. No! That was on me. That wasn't Kimmy. That was on me. I swung too late. Shoot. It's okay, Kimmy. That was not your fault. That's okay. You just go get some rest, Kimmy, sweetheart. Some losers okay. lose all the time. <laughs> Which is the side you occupy. <laughs> Doggone it. <laughs> Doggone it, Kimmy. <laughs> all right, all right. I think the coach believes in you, Marky. We can hit a power and get a grand slam. If you don't, then ooh, that's the inning. Don't swing at that. What the? Come on! Come on! Ump! That was not overlapping with the shadow at all. Wow! They already swapped after four pitches because two of those pitches were the Dragon Tails Dragonfire pitches. That's just ridiculous. Way too low. No way. No way you're swinging at that one, Marky. Marky, if you don't hit it over the fence, though, we're, that's probably the end of the inning. Right here. Okay. For, for real with Marky. We gotta hope Amir screws this up real bad. Amir did not screw this up real bad. Okay, well... Shoot. That was, uh... Yikes. That, that seemed like it was a wasted opportunity. It, it was. I feel bad that I swung too late on that Kimmy Ekman hit, because if I hadn't, I, that may have been it. That was a, a heat on the outside. It was the perfect recipe. This should be easy. This should be easy. We got this. Just make sure that they don't get five points, and we win. One day, I would just love Angela to pick a ball up off the ground without just diving chest first on top of it. That would be really nice. Alright, we do have that nice carton of juice, though. Alright. Uh, let's, let's do the big cheese. Get out Cindy Chain. Guess we're not getting out Cindy Chain with the big freeze. Good job, Angela. Nice strikeout. Sorry, Cindy. Them's the breaks. Who's up next? Ah, Kathy! The girl who threw four pitches and then immediately had to sit down. Alright, Angela. You can drink your Dragon Tails juice. And we just need one more out. Angela, eight strikeouts today. That's crazy. Good job. We haven't thrown a zigzag before. Let's do it. They would hit that. Oh, hey! She didn't trip. No, she did. Never mind. Doesn't count. We still got her out! Yes! <laughs> got her out with a zigzag. Everybody's so excited on the field. They're jumping up and down. Even the parents out in the stands are dancing around out there. I think I even saw somebody's dog leaping in the air. Until <laughs> next time, this is Sunny Day. And that was probably Marky's dog. Alright, 5-0, yeah. New York Yankees, absolute pushover. 
Oh, man, I'm disappointed that I didn't get the Grand Slam of Kimmy, though. That would have been so epic. But, well, you win some, you lose some. And we are undefeated winners for this league. Yes. Oh, I'm excited. And now it's time for everyone's... Oh, heads up. Congratulations, you broke the following records this season for hits, runs batted in, runs batting average, steals, and strikeouts pitched. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. Uh, Melonheads won? How? They're the worst. <laughs> they are actually the worst. Oh, Detroit Tigers lost. Yeah, big surprise there. Oh, yes. Now it's time for everybody's favorite paper, sports. <laughs> Just everyone. It's the best. <laughs> All eyes on the prize. Players focus in as playoffs start. All eyes are on the Bombers as they enter the playoffs. A win in the playoffs leads to the league championships. And finally, the Backyard World Series are... <laughs> <laughs> it's a long road to travel, but we think we're ready. Says Coach R3. <laughs> the third Adi. <laughs> yes, why? Who will take home the giant trophy from the World Series? First, the playoffs must happen. <laughs> All right, so we are in the playoffs. Oh, it's us versus the White Sox. Yes, guys. Us versus the White Sox. That means Marky gets a stat boost every single playoff game. <laughs> yes. Marky boost. <laughs> That's exactly what we need. Oh, man, that's fantastic. Then we got Rangers versus the Hornets, Rockies versus the Expos, and Diamondbacks versus the Reds. Just making a prediction, Rangers, Reds, and Expos are probably going to be the winners, along with us. If we lose to the White Sox when we have a stat-boosted Marky going against them, then, like, what are we even doing with our lives? Seriously. All right, Chico Papas had the most home runs. At least it wasn't Ray Tran. Pete Weaver with the most hits. PJ Sharif with the most doubles. Libby Futterman with the most triples. Pablo with most runs batted in. Thank you, Ray Tran. Pete Wheeler with the most runs scored. Yeah, Pete Wheeler with the highest batting average. Chico Papas with the highest slugging percentage. Pete Wheeler with by far the most steals. Good lord. Angela Delvecchio with by far the most strikeouts. Good lord. Uh, Julie Dunkel with the highest earned run average. Matthew LaCruz with the most errors. Oh, oh. Well, this is going to be interesting. So now we are in the playoffs. It is the battle for the pennant in the division championship. This should be interesting, but I am definitely confident that we can get it done. Especially with Marky getting a little bit of help from the anti-sock propaganda. That would just be absolutely fantastic. <laughs> I can't wait already. Yeah, Pablo definitely MVP of the game. But I gotta admit, like, Pete did great as well. And so did Angela. Angela pitched an insane game today. Just fantastic. Just fantastic. Wendy on the Diamondbacks, Courtney on the Expos, and Ray Tran. And the Rangers are on the playoffs. Guys, you know what's gonna happen. I'm predicting we're facing Ray Tran in the, uh, in the World Series. I am predicting that, and it will be hilarious if we do, but that's really going to be a tough matchup because their team was really good. <laughs> Ironically, Ray Tran was one of the weaker people on their team, and yet he's infamous. Man, you just you just know Ray Tran is going to be in the World Series. I guess, I guess if we face off against him in the uh, tournament then that will change things, but I'm, I'm predicting right now Ray Tran in the World Series. I'm... I'm just predicting that. Oh, I, I haven't been remembering to eat my candy stars. That's okay. I'm just eating healthier, I suppose. <laughs> yeah, that home run kind of... Actually, if it weren't for that home run, would we have scored at all? We would have gotten, like, one, maybe two points, but... I think we only would have gotten one point if Pablo hadn't hit that home run. So, yeah, good job, Pablo. Good night, DX. Thanks for joining in. You think Ray Train will beat me? No way. No chance. Oh, wait. They're in the second seed, so we will guaranteed face Ray Tran before the World Series? Oh. Oh, well, then never mind. No. No. We're not facing Ray Tran in the World Series. Okay, in that case... If it's... So we're facing the Reds, the Diamondbacks, the Rockies, or the Expos. I'm guessing we're facing the Reds. And if we go to the... Oh, we can't see the Reds team. I forget what the Reds team has. Uh, maybe, maybe there will be someone in the league leaders for the Reds. 
Maybe. Possibly. Hopefully. Definitely. Maybe not. Oh, Libby Futterman. They got Libby. I don't actually remember if we ever faced off against the Reds this season. I don't think we did. So, I'm guessing Reds will be the World Series, so we'll be going up against the Libby Futterman, whoever the heck she is. I don't even know. Mm -mm. Well, there we go. Undefeated for the league games. And going into the playoffs, we have 14 wins. It's just fantastic. Such a great feeling. And it's such a great feeling knowing we will be having that perma marquee stat boost for the playoff games. Would have been great to have that for the World Series, but I will take it where I can get it. I'm just glad the Sox made it into the finals at all. So, that's going to do it for this game. Thank you for joining in, everybody.